there are a lot of people that are interested in crime stories these days. Why is your show something that they should add to their watch list? Yeah, so there's a lot of interest in crime shows these days. And the thing that I am most excited about with Crime Scene Confidential is this is the first time that we are hearing about crime and crime information from the perspective of a crime scene investigator. Uh, my job in this show, I view as to navigate and translate the case through the perspective of the physical evidence. And physical evidence is super important to me because physical evidence does not lie. The forensic science of the case is not biased which I think is also super important um, in this day and age that we have transparency and a lack of bias in our investigation. And that's, that's forensic science. It doesn't have a stake in the game. It simply is, or it is not, it doesn't have a narrative or an agenda. We just as investigators look at what the evidence is telling us. And we follow that path. We don't have a path that we then look at the evidence to take us to. It goes the other way around. And Crime Scene Confidential looks at the physical evidence of the case. So it's not looking at the story from the police, the detectives, uh, the behavior of people, because we know that uh, you know one of our taglines is science doesn't lie, people do. We're not looking at that, we're looking at the evidence. And then we're allowing our audience to kind of go underneath the tape of the crime scene and then make their own decisions as to what they believe based on the facts of the case and the science. Is Twitter gonna be jumping and talking about all the, the crime scenes that we see? Oh, it is. And that's what I love is the conversations that it starts, the thoughts, it's thought provoking. Um, you know, I have, of course, friends, family, and then, you know, the, the ID addicts out there that love to discuss and yes you know the twitter verse uh my instagram uh you know always after the show because i i try to be very neutral in the presentation of the show right i don't state my opinions i say this is the physical evidence and i speak to the investigators and the people that were closest to the case sometimes it's defense sometimes it's prosecution sometimes it's medical examiners or investigators first responding officers and I get their expert opinions, and then I present the evidence. So our viewers, when they're done, they see all the sides, all the evidence, and then they are left, my CSIs that I'm bringing along with me, they are left to make a conclusion of what they feel based on the evidence that they've seen. And I know I have so many people that go, Alina, man, we watched the show last night, and for an hour, my husband and I went back and forth, and he thinks this, and I think this. And we had these conversations, but I love that. I love that it's getting people talking, not just about evidence, but about our justice system, about our perceptions of what people, killers look like, about um, bias, about domestic violence, about all kinds of things that we should be talking about. 